I've been in this league a long time, and I, I you know, I don't, I, I don't have a platform on a national level like some people. But this league is, in my in my view, top to bottom, the best league in the country. But and the men's league gets a lot of credit, and they deserve it. Our league's just as good. There, there's no bottom to our league. You know, some leagues there's a bottom. There's no bottom here. A new home, the T-Mobile Center in Kansas City, Missouri. A new era. Four new teams to the Big 12 tournament in a new format. Five days, four teams that received and have earned double buys, but still one champion. Welcome to the Phillips 66 Big 12 Women's Basketball Championship. Eric rattles one in. This is their step back shot. Another three, good. Jada win. Jumper poured in for Williams. Three, and that is how they got their way back into this game. Ariel Jackson. Winning cures a lot of things, um, and I think that that adrenaline that it that it can muster up um, is certainly something that that we will ride into tomorrow. You know, this game is meant to be played for fun. And I feel like when you lose and you, can, and you, and you really don't have a lot of control over that, it, it can suck the life out of you. out to me you guys because we have put ourselves in a position that we should be confident okay we should be confident okay but you can't fear failure you can't fear failure okay because doubt kills more dreams than failure ever will like we got to come out we got to be confident okay but our confident can't get in the way of our energy and our effort okay because teams in March that want to win championships don't take any possession for granted Okay, they're limited. Let's make the most of them. And truly have no regrets. Every minute you get on the court, freaking leave your heart out there. Okay, and this is the best part about March Madness. Okay, freaking winner stays, loser goes home. Crystal clear. Okay, we ain't ready to go home yet. Okay, 40 minutes. Here we go. Let's go. our last game so that's our um, expectation for this team. Here's, here's the, the good thing about coaching is we're not even close to being the same team that we were in, in early January and I give our players a lot of credit for growing and improving. Uh, with that being said, you know Texas is Final Four national champion good. Um, led by a, a freshman that's just having an incredible year. So um, very, very difficult challenge, especially on a, on a short turnaround like this with them getting the bye. So, um, yeah, I think, uh, you know, we'll, we won't spend a lot of time looking at that film because they kicked our butt. Um, and, and hopefully uh, we're a little bit better and uh, can be more competitive uh, tomorrow evening. Spins 
cycle. In a two minute, two second scoring drought for OK State. That's the bad news. Good news are down just a bucket. Noble changes that. Sixty-six. Coach Hoyt wants a timeout. As soon as someone attacks the basket, reach for the ball. We're playing normal man. No, 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 no
and they won a league title for a reason. And to, to beat the champs, you, you, you have to be on your A game, and today we weren't. very March type of basketball game, um, but we're, we're lucky to survive in advance, so we're on to the next. Welcome to the Phillips 66 Big 12 Women's Basketball Championship. We are in downtown Kansas City, inside the T-Mobile Center, where the top four seeds have advanced to the semifinals, and they are teams with a lot of success. Four-time tournament champion Oklahoma looking to return to the final for the first time since 2010. Iowa State has won three championships in their history, and they won it all last year. The fifth-ranked team in the country, the Texas Longhorns, are looking to return to the final for the third year in a row, and they will face the 16th-ranked team, Kansas State Wildcats. They're trying to get to the championship final for the first time since 2005. Kick out to Jones, there's Kelsey Jones for three. on the shot clock. Brooks draws the contact. In this game, I don't think we responded well or started well or really finished well. Um, and at the same time, I'm excited to be able to see what we continue to do because two months ago, we didn't have a future in postseason. Now we do. So I'm going to be really excited to see how we respond to that. Now you're at that point where you're playing for a championship tomorrow. This is three out of the four years I've been at Texas. It's what we do, y'all. They're coming, they're, you, you know they're feeling pretty good. They just beat the snot out of them by 30. I mean, just destroyed them. So, but that's all right. And, and, hey, listen, we've got to come with our game tomorrow and we'll be fine. You need to embrace this opportunity again it is what we do, but there's no guarantees. You're in this moment for a reason. Embrace it. It's why you came to Texas. It's why we all came to Texas, myself included. So embrace this moment from now until tomorrow night at 8 when we tip it off. Embrace it. Two teams remain for the championship final tonight. Shay Holly splashes down a three-pointer. She's been in double each of the two games here in Kansas City. Bellinger steps into a three count. Madison Booker is in double figures already. Shay Holly, and there's that endurance coming into play. You don't win conference championship games like you just did. 
you played really, really well, really well. And we couldn't have done it. Everybody in this room is responsible. You all, I hope you enjoyed your time out there because it's, it's really hard to do what y'all have done. Big 12 champs on three. One, two, three. Big 12 champs.